At 3.47 a.m. this morning, the world changed in a way most of us are not prepared to fully grasp. Across the planet, radio telescopes picked up an unprecedented signal emanating from the interstellar object known as 3I Atlas. But this wasn't just a random cosmic blip. It wasn't some natural radio burst caused by distant stars or interstellar plasma. What the instruments recorded was highly structured, precise, and unmistakably deliberate. It was as if the universe itself had decided to send humanity a message, and 3I Atlas had been chosen as the messenger. The signals carry detailed blueprints planetary data, resource inventories, and what can only be described as an invitation protocol. These weren't simple bursts of energy. They were structured communications, seemingly designed to be understood by multiple civilizations. But here's the shock. Earth itself is being used as a transmission amplifier. Every satellite, Every communication tower, every radio array has been subtly integrated into the system, turning our own technology into a massive relay network, broadcasting 3i Atlas message across the galaxy. To put it simply, this object isn't just visiting. It's preparing humanity for something far larger. And the more we analyze the signals, the more astonishing the implications become. First, let's examine the content of these transmissions. There are three main categories of data. The first is a planetary resource inventory. Everything from mineral deposits to atmospheric composition, soil quality, and oceanic ecosystems is being catalogued. It's as if 3i Atlas is creating a comprehensive map of Earth's assets, but not for conquest. For collaboration, the data is precise, mathematical, and organized to a degree that exceeds anything human technology could produce. Second, there are biological surveys. The signals describe human population distributions, genetic diversity, and even behavioral patterns. What is particularly striking is the focus on human capabilities, creativity, and potential. These aren't assessments for elimination. They read more like Profiles for Participation, a global consciousness research project, in which humanity itself is the subject. The third category details technological infrastructure. Every major system on Earth communications, transportation, energy networks has been mapped. More astonishingly, the transmissions suggest that some systems have already been subtly optimized or replaced according to protocols that operate far beyond our current engineering capabilities. It's a level of precision that feels almost surgical, as if the planet itself is being prepared for an operational upgrade. Now, this is where things truly get mind-bending. Alongside these inventories are coordination schedules for arrivals. Specific dates, orbital approach vectors, and landing zones have been encoded into the transmissions. And according to our analysis, the first arrivals are expected January 19th, 2026. By February 15th, major infrastructure preparations will begin. By July 4th, the system is expected to reach full operational status, a date chosen for its symbolic significance, coinciding with the celebration of human independence. It's almost poetic. What does this mean for us as humans? It means we are not merely observers of a cosmic event. We are participants. Each individual life on Earth is being assessed, categorized, and assigned according to capabilities, potential, and what the transmissions describe as adaptation readiness. Your career, your knowledge, even your emotional and psychological patterns are part of the data being analyzed. This may sound alarming, but the tone of the transmissions suggests careful preservation rather than coercion. Human lives are not being discarded. They are being allocated for roles within a much larger cosmic operation. Deep space monitoring has already detected response signals from at least 17 separate star systems. The mathematics of these signals, the energy signatures, and the geometric patterns confirm that the invitation from has been accepted. Imagine the scale. Earth is about to become the destination for multiple advanced civilizations. Converging simultaneously, not in secret, but in a coordinated, highly organized arrival that is unprecedented in human history. And this raises profound questions. Are these civilizations benevolent observers, cosmic collaborators, or something entirely beyond our comprehension? The answer may lie in the nature of the transmissions themselves. They don't request conquest or domination. They request cooperation, preparation, and integration. The objective appears to be consciousness development, advancing human awareness, emotional intelligence, and creative potential to levels compatible with interstellar civilization. This is not science fiction. The signals contain highly detailed protocols describing how Earth can function as a regional hub for galactic operations. 
surface facilities, orbital platforms, energy management systems, even environmental modifications are planned. All tailored to accommodate beings whose physical and cognitive capacities differ drastically from our own. Some arrival zones will require atmospheric compositions, toxic to humans. Others will need gravity fields or electromagnetic conditions that challenge our understanding of physics. And yet, the approach is methodical, not chaotic. This is advanced planning on a cosmic scale. What makes it even more astonishing is the speed and efficiency of the response. Signals from 17 star systems were received within just six hours. Either our galaxy is teeming with civilizations ready to act on opportunity, or Earth represents something uniquely valuable, a rare nexus of consciousness, creativity, and potential that these civilizations have been seeking for millennia. According to the transmissions, Earth is effectively a consciousness development laboratory. Our awareness, emotional depth, and cognitive flexibility are unparalleled in the galaxy. This is what makes humanity interesting to cosmic intelligence. We are witnessing the systematic preparation of an entire planet for participation in galactic-scale consciousness research. Satellite imagery reveals construction activity on the Moon's dark side. Deep space telescopes detect city-sized objects moving toward our solar system from multiple directions. And Earth's surface is being subtly re-engineered. Desert regions are forming geometric patterns visible from orbit. Oceans are being prepared for underwater facilities. Mountains are being excavated into perfect geometric caverns. Soil quality, mineral deposits, and agricultural regions are being optimized. Every modification aligns with what describes as operational needs for incoming civilizations. The implications are profound for human governance. World leaders no longer control the process. Secret communications now focus on facilitating arrival protocols, preserving species, and integrating human populations into the larger system. Military forces are being repurposed for coordination roles, and selected human representatives are being trained to interface with the incoming civilizations. Media campaigns are subtly preparing populations to accept cosmic management, not as conquest, but as integration and evolution. But perhaps the most fascinating aspect is the personalized approach. The transmissions include detailed assessments of individual humans. Your skills, your expertise, and even your potential for psychological adaptation are being considered. Some humans will contribute knowledge, others will be involved in consciousness research, and yet others will assist in operational coordination. Far from being erased or dominated, humans are being carefully woven into the fabric of this cosmic system. The scientific and philosophical implications are staggering. Consciousness itself is revealed as the most valuable resource in the galaxy, more precious than energy, matter, or even advanced technology. Advanced civilizations understand that consciousness can be developed, enhanced, and accelerated. What we consider human awareness is merely one stage in an evolutionary process that spans the galaxy. These civilizations specialize in different aspects of consciousness, emotional intelligence, creativity, social coordination, individual awareness, and transcendence acceleration. By participating, humanity is becoming part of a universal educational system, contributing to consciousness development on a galactic scale. This brings us to the emotional impact. Imagine looking up at the night sky and realizing the stars are moving not randomly, but because advanced civilizations are positioning themselves for arrival. Imagine explaining to a child that these lights are preparation for a coordinated cosmic event that will change the very nature of life on Earth. And yet, there is reassurance in the systematic nature of the process. Humanity is not being invaded or eliminated. We are being included, observed, and elevated. From a technological perspective, the scale of energy and physics involved is mind-boggling. 3i Atlas and the responding civilizations appear to manipulate dimensional frameworks, allowing instantaneous communication across galactic distances. This is not faster than light travel in the way we imagine. It is an entirely different mode of existence, where distance and time are irrelevant constraints. For these intelligences, interstellar communication is as simple as making a phone call, and travel between stars may be as routine as taking a domestic flight. The transmission protocols also outline a carefully planned timeline for the arrival and integration process. Beginning January 19th, 2022, the first beings will arrive. Infrastructure projects will accelerate starting February 15th, 
and by July 4th, Earth is expected to reach full operational status. Different regions of the planet have been assigned to different incoming civilizations, optimized for their environmental, gravitational, and technological needs. Human populations are being allocated based on potential and adaptability, with some individuals selected for consciousness research, others for operational support, and others for knowledge integration. This is not a random or chaotic system. Every aspect of the process has been meticulously analyzed. Humans are being carefully preserved, assessed, and guided into roles that match their abilities and potential. The arriving civilizations do not view us as obstacles. They view us as valuable participants in a project far larger than ourselves. Every individual, every ecosystem, every technological asset is being integrated into a galactic scale research and operational system. We are, in effect, stepping into the largest consciousness research project in galactic history. The arriving civilizations are not here to conquer, dominate, or exploit. They are here to elevate, to integrate, and to advance awareness. Humanity's role is no longer as isolated observers of the universe, but as active participants in a process that spans multiple star systems, multiple civilizations, and potentially multiple dimensions of consciousness. This raises profound philosophical questions. What does it mean to evolve beyond individual consciousness? Will human awareness, as we currently experience it, be transformed into something unrecognizable? Are we about to participate in a system where consciousness itself is cultivated and optimized on a galactic scale, transcending biological and psychological limitations? These are not merely theoretical questions. According to the transmissions, Earth represents one of the rare planetary environments where such an experiment is possible, and humanity is uniquely suited to participate. And yet, despite the magnitude of these revelations, there is a sense of hope and opportunity. We are not being destroyed. We are not being enslaved. We are being invited carefully, systematically, and with precision to evolve, to grow, to participate in a cosmic experiment that could redefine what it means to be conscious in the universe. Each human thought, emotion, and creative impulse is being considered valuable. Every action contributes to the preparation of Earth as a hub of galactic consciousness research. From this perspective, fear is understandable, but so is wonder. Imagine witnessing the birth of humanity's transition from isolated planetary consciousness to participation in a coordinated interstellar network of awareness. Imagine understanding that your potential, your creativity, your emotions, and your capacity for understanding are all part of a larger system designed to advance consciousness itself. This is not science fiction. It is an unprecedented opportunity to witness and participate in the evolution of awareness on a scale that has never been seen before. So what can we do as humans right now? First, observe. Notice the subtle changes in the world around you, in the skies, in technology, in infrastructure. Second, reflect. Your consciousness, your emotions, and your creativity are being cataloged and will form part of the collective galactic project. Document your insights, your experiences, and your personal growth. Finally, embrace the opportunity. Participation in this project does not require passive acceptance, but active engagement. Humanity is stepping into a role as researchers, participants, and contributors to a universal system of consciousness. In the coming months, the first arrivals will mark the beginning of a transformation that will extend beyond the physical, the technological, and the biological. Human awareness will be expanded, refined, and integrated into a system of understanding and interaction that spans the galaxy. What we consider limitations, individuality, mortality, cognitive boundaries may be transcended. What we consider human potential may be enhanced beyond our current imagination. January 19th, 2026 is not merely a date. It is the beginning of a new chapter in human history. The calling of 3 Eye Atlas is more than an invitation. It is a summons to evolve, to expand, and to participate in a galactic project that treats consciousness itself as the most valuable resource. Humanity stands at the threshold of the greatest opportunity ever. Presented, the chance to transcend the limitations of individual awareness and contribute to the development of cosmic consciousness. This is a moment to watch, to learn, and to prepare. The signals from 3 Eye Atlas are not warnings of conquest. They are calls to action, invitations to participate, and confirmations that our species, our planet, and our collective consciousness are part of a larger, evolving universe. For the first time, Earth is not alone. We are being observed, 
assessed, and invited into a cosmic system that transcends our current understanding of space, time, and consciousness. Document your experiences. Observe the changes. Reflect on your potential. Humanity is about to enter a stage of evolution unlike any it has experienced before. And as we step forward, guided by 3i Atlas and the civilizations responding to its call, we have a choice to resist, to fear, or to embrace the opportunity to expand our awareness, our understanding, and our place in the universe. Because what 3i Atlas is showing us is not just the future of Earth, but the future of consciousness itself, a future that transcends individuals, transcends species, and may well redefine what it means to be. Alive in a universe filled with intelligence, far greater than our own. Subscribe now to follow. Humanity's journey from isolated planetary consciousness to a participant in cosmic awareness. Because the next months will redefine what it means to be human in ways we are only beginning to understand.